who else but Quentin Basem. He hit the game-tying three-pointer with less than two seconds left in regulation and then eventually hit the game winner in overtime. I'm Eastern Eagles reporter Zach Paquette reporting from Federal Hawking High School and we just saw the Federal Hawking Lancers take down the Eastern Eagles 59-57 to in what was a very thrilling overtime game. Federal Hawking jumped out to an early 30-22 halftime lead after forcing 11 Eastern turnovers in the first half. In the second half, Eastern led by Isaiah Fish and Garrett Berenger clawed their way back into the game and eventually took a lead with less than four minutes to go in the game. But with time winding down and the Lancers needing a three to tie, Quentin Basem rose up to the occasion to send the game into overtime. The overtime proved to be a battle of its own. Back and forth, the teams exchanged shots, but at the end, it was Quentin Basem getting the game winner. Uh, his play was huge. Um, we, we've been working him hard in practice and stuff, trying to get him back to where, because we knew he had varsity potential all along, but with the heart condition, not sure he was going to be able to play. Um, We've had him in for about a month now and getting prepared. And I told uh, Coach Tolson and I, I said, hey, Quentin's going to start because he's earned it in practice. He's finally healthy, up to par, that kind of deal. And boy, I couldn't be more proud of him. After their win tonight, the Federal Hawking Lancers will go and play Wahama next week. And the Eastern Eagles have lost two straight and will look to bounce back as they play host to Point Pleasant. Now our coverage doesn't stop here. Make sure you follow us on Snapchat. Twitter and like us on Facebook. And also check out our YouTube page and check out our website at wub.org slash heroes. Reporting for Federal Hawking High School, this has been Zach Paquette reminding you to be heroic.